I'm so glad that you've decided to take this journey with me. There are so many voices in our culture that are fighting for our attention, trying to tell us how to be and how to dress, what to believe and what to act. And in the Bible, Proverbs 14, 12, it says there is a path before each man that seems right, but the end of that path is death. Now that is a sobering truth. What that means is that a lot of people think that they are making choices and decisions, that they're walking down a path that's gonna lead them to something great, but it's actually gonna lead them to destruction. See girls, the truth is that our lives are made up of choices. We can choose to live our lives following the Lord, or we can choose to make decisions that are not gonna honor God and are probably gonna lead us in a terrible, terrible place. The choices you make today are setting you up for the next 15 to 20 years of your life. Now I know you might be thinking, oh no, I'm young. I'm not thinking about the next 20 years of my life. I understand when I was a teenager, I wasn't thinking that either. But I'm telling you, I have seen girls who have made choices right now during these teenage years that have led them in a path of success and other girls who have made choices in these teen years that have led them to a path of destruction. Some girls get involved with boys and might get pregnant and that sets the trajectory of their life in one direction. They might get involved in drugs or drop out of school and all of those decisions are setting up the next 10, 15, 20 years of their life. But I've seen other young women who decide that they're going to follow the Lord. Other young women who decide that they're going to get involved in their church or they're going to start studying their Bible. They're going to go to college. They're going to do something positive. And man, does it set them up for the next 20, 25 years of their life. See, God wants to invade your life right now and show you that his way is best. We can look at our culture or Instagram or Snapchat TikTok, whatever social media site you might be on, you can try to look at all those things and try to find the way that you are supposed to go. But the truth is that only God knows the way that you're supposed to go. He's the one that can show you the path of life that's going to bring you the most fulfillment. This Bible study is broken up into four sections. It's broken up into the gift, the guard, the guarantee, and the grace. And you can go as quickly as you want or as slow as you want, but I pray that in each section with each lesson, you would take the time to listen, reflect, and pray and ask God what he wants to do in your life. Thanks for coming on this journey with me. Let's be women of wisdom. We are making a vow to hashtag not be dumb.